Oh, hello, Peter Chow here. Now, all you people on the message board, okay, on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, you always ask me, okay, what does my new house look like? Okay, I'm going to show you today. Okay, let's go. Wait a second. Beware of dog, okay? More like dog, beware of Peter Chow, right? Because if I get angry, I am going to eat it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, okay? Shut up! The dog's so scared of me. He go running back to Michael Vick. Ah, okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Right here we have a nice garden, you know. Okay, right here. This is where I transport the Mexican immigrant from the United States into Canada. Okay, they have trouble coming into the United States from Mexico. But right here, the wheelbarrow works perfectly. 100% of the time, you can take the Mexican, throw in the wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow all the way to the Canada. Ooh, Mexico! Ooh, United States! Ooh, Canada! Okay, let's go. But one thing I want to show you is why the fuck is this tree smiling, okay? It does not have an eye, okay? Whoever lived here before must be retard because people who don't have one eye do not smile, okay? It does not make sense. Okay, time to go inside the house. You ready? Let's go. Okay, welcome to the inside of Peter Chow's house. After I wheelbarrow the Mexican from the United States into Canada, this is where I keep them. So come on over, okay? Right here. Okay, plenty of space. You can just, uh, you know, sit in there. You can pretty much do anything you want in there. You can cook dinner, okay? Not to plan, no, okay. Okay, Peter Chow can't fit, but I'm sure that Mexican can, so no problem, okay? Okay, on to the next room. This is what's important. You have to have the 50-inch big motherfucking TV. That's what impress the mother bitches. Most mother bitches, I tell you, they don't care about the DVD or Blu-ray, okay? They don't even notice the difference. So you just put on a fucking movie, then you start making out. And then, on to the bedroom. Okay, so this is Peter Chow's bedroom. Now, this is the best place for sex, and I'll tell you why, okay? Hop onto the bed. Ah, right here, and you know, you know, Peter Chow like to like to look at himself so much. Okay, so it's perfect. You can fucking hump your mother bitch and look at yourself at the same time. Ah. Oh yes, and I forgot the most important thing. Okay, you like the romantic setting. You have to have the fireplace, okay? You turn it on, it's fake, okay? You use the gas, okay? Whatever. The bitches don't care because what they do is you sit them down right here. You sit them down, or you put your arm around her, okay? Okay, they are eventually, they're going to get really hot. And you know what happens when the mother bitches get really hot? They take off their clothes, okay? You take off their clothes right here, and then you can just walk her naked right into the bedroom, okay? Straight into it, no waiting, no hesitation, okay? And speaking of bang, 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 okay? Nice place to bang, 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 it's right in the shower. You got the water spraying all over you. It's sexy, you're naked, okay? Unless you're one of those retired motherfuckers who shower with clothes on. Then, you know, okay, that's your problem, okay? But you open the door, okay? Plenty of place to stand, okay? Yes, yes, okay, it's very important, it's very good. So Peter Chow used the X, okay? You can wash each other, you can rub each other, you know, you know, it's very nice. You can just really have some fun inside, okay? So, that's the bathroom. I hope you enjoy the MTV style creep show of Peter Chow House. And if you're a sexy mother bitch, you're going to like this place. It is so much better than my last shitty apartment, okay? So come on over and have sexy time all the time, okay? Ciao, outside, motherfucker!